Marshall Patel has been ruled out of the tournament um, as of yesterday. So he he suffered a fracture in his right hand in the game against Kings Eleven. Um, it took us a few days to actually get to the bottom of, of that fracture. He's had some X-rays and. Uh, so he's been given uh, it's a, a three or four week injury, which basically ruled him out of the tournament. And, and so far in the tournament, he's got us off to some really good starts. You know, I think he was probably single-handedly the reason that we won the game in in um, Bangalore. I mean, Sreya's played well, but the the power play start that we got really put that game away for us early. So, look, he's he's developing every day. He's learning more and more about. T20 cricket every day. He's learning more about his T20 batting every day, and if he keeps improving, then I'm sure he'll be one of the leading run scorers come the end of this tournament. I'm sure. And he's look. He's just said all along that just expect it to be a very good pitch. And the wickets here, the last couple of years have been exceptionally good. I think that you know the reason they have been so good is the curators decided to leave it just a little bit more grass on. They haven't sort of spun as much, and they've had pretty good pace and bounce. Um, and the ball tends to swing a bit here as well because of the humid conditions. So. Um, the two games have been played so far, I think it was 183 in the first game and then about 218 in the second game. So, uh, look, it's just a... I just love the venue. It's a great place to play cricket. Um, our joy, our, and our guys will certainly enjoy themselves tomorrow night. He's a terrific, terrific young man. He's a very determined young man. He's a very, very good player. Uh, he's developing his leadership all the time. And, you know, he's, he's only been at it for a short period of time, as you say. Halfway through last day, IPL, he got to captain Mumbai this year and he obviously captained India A. So he's still, it's all still quite new to him and it's a, it's a high-pressure environment that he's working in. You know, the IPL is a, a difficult place to, to play and it's a difficult place to captain in. But, um, look, he's, he's doing a great job. I love working with him. Um, hope he, hopefully he says the same thing and, and hopefully he can, he, he can captain a few more wins as this tournament goes on. KG, exceptionally determined man. Uh, he's, he's very intelligent. He's got great skills, uh, first and foremost. And I mean, he's bowling. He's bowled over 150 kilometres an hour a few times in this tournament as well. So, you know, I think is he still the leading wicket taker? He must be still the leading wicket taker. Yeah. So to have to have that in our side is um, is awesome. And that I mean, that's why you pay the big money for these overseas players because you, it's, it, like I was saying about Rishab, you expect them to win games for you. And you know, he bowled b beautifully in the game in Bangalore. You know, got. Coley and De Villiers out in that game. He won us a super over as well when he when he knocked Russell's middle stump out of the ground in that super over. Um, but he's just a really calm, relaxed guy around the team until he gets the ball in his hand. Then things change from there. He's got a bit of an aggressive side to him. Um, but it, yeah, it, it's great to have those guys around. You know, he's he's experienced as well. And and the IPL, as far as I'm concerned, is about trying to put a team together that's got the right balance of of youth and experience. And and we feel that we've got it, got that in our team. So. Subscribe to our channel, just click on the bell icon for all the latest updates.